Good morning, everybody. I'm Dark Side Phil, and I'm here to take over the world. During World War II, the Nazis, that's right, the Third Reich, actually won the war. Today, right here live, I'm gonna be as honest and transparent with you as possible. Uh, I need help today. Here's why. I have two very large bills that come due. So, I don't have, I, I don't have money for pet supplies. I, you know, this is the day that I have one day a week where I have a meal with my wife. I wanna get to a point in my life where it's not like this. We were getting there last year when Twitch fucked me. You guys have no idea. No, you really don't. You have no idea how bad it hurt me last year. I was making $5,000 in profit every month. I need your help today. I do. I need to be hitting support goals. I have to. If I don't hit my support goals for today, I, you know, I don't have enough funds for tomorrow. And I don't want to talk about this. I'm fucking pissed. I'm actually fucking upset that I have to bring this shit up. It was because of the direct actions of scumbags that screwed me over and put me in a position where I had to start talking about, I need help, I need support, please support crowdfunding, blah, blah, blah. You know? If I stream today and I hit none of the goals, I'm fucked. And essentially, I'll, I'll be going grocery shopping. I guess we're going to eat a, eat, a, eat a lunch meat sandwich, you know, for our day off. Can't even have a meal out or nothing. The point I'm making here is simple. I'm not asking for anyone to go above and beyond their means. I'm not asking for anything that makes you uncomfortable. I'm just saying if you like the content and you've been thinking about contributing and you haven't yet, please do. I'm not asking for anything crazy. I'm not saying go crazy and go above your means. But if you like the content, maybe you've been holding off on contributing or you've been thinking about contributing in one way, I would ask that if you are gonna contribute today, please tip me. That would help me for tomorrow dramatically. It would allow me to have my day off with my wife, which we deserve, which we didn't even get. But if you can go above and beyond, hey, consider becoming a channel member, in particular today. The best way to help me would be to tip me. You have to have that consistency, and that's really what I'm looking for. I'm looking for consistency. I'm looking at every day, no matter what I play or what I stream, I can basically get a certain amount of support and funding, but I've got thousands of people watching me all over the world. A lot of them are really stupid, but they're still watching. Hype is a hell of a drug. Let's put it that way. What does that mean? Nothing. You get nothing for it. It's just an arbitrary thing to claim that you made progress. It doesn't add anything at all. It's essentially a big bullying campaign where at any point, oh, wait, fuck you. We'll be bully you down and punish you and do this and do that. What we need to do is find a way to cater to those who are already here, who are dedicated, and then to convince mouth drooling, sheepish, parroting morons who believe everything you're told by people who are bringing this shit up to make money and get popularity on the internet. When you have a monopoly, you know, there's no competition that could stand up to it, and therefore people will be mistreated, all right? Not every day, but some days. And the older I get, the worse this is gonna get, right? We know this, okay? People would definitely become members to see this kind of toxic content on DSP Gaming. We all know this. I can tell you right now, my priority is WWE Champions, because that's the game that you guys have been asking for for the longest time, and it seems like a lot of people want to see it. By the way, I don't mind. I like the WWE games, and you guys absolutely love the devil in me, right? I think what happens is you get a more dedicated, a more invested group of viewers here on DSP Gaming because there are a bunch of stupid mouth drooling idiots who just can't fucking control themselves and therefore you need to have rules and regulations laid out so that people can be protected from their stupidity. It's that simple. I'm trying to maintain a chill vibe here on my stream and the last thing that I want is all that derailed by a bunch of idiots so we have to have rules in place. At this point, I'm just, I'm just not going to pay attention to you anymore. I'm just going to say thanks for the dollar tip and never read your message ever again because you're an idiot. What have we been saying recently? All right. When I hit 40 years old this year in April, we started having a conversation, right? We did. And what was that conversation about? The conversation was that as I get older, all right, I'm degraded into a sewer of toxicity and scams and all kinds of messed up things and trick, oh, click here, tri trick you into fucking spending money and shit. But you guys love this.
Raise your right hand right now. Full transparency, I'm craving war. Craving. The truth of the matter is thus, I hate communism. I'm ready for war. I'm dying for, for content here. I want war. So what that means, ladies and gentlemen, is that we're going to do something very special, all right? This vest, this vest is very special. It symbolizes to me almost a turnaround, like a turnaround of opinion towards me, that people actually like me and support my content, especially the fact that there's so many people that claim that I'm the worst person on the internet, right? But it seems to me like that's changing. And so this vest is a symbol of that positivity. It's a symbol that together we can have fun as long as we stay positive and we can overcome anything together. I firmly believe. I firmly believe at this point in my life, all right, that no matter what comes my way, that we can work together to overcome it. All right, but that being said, it's time for something new. We must secure the existence of our people and a future for white children. <laughs> so there you go, my friends. That's what we're doing today. But what's, what's the, what is the best solution for the future? I think this is the discussion we need to start. I do feel that way. Like, we should start looking at, at things in a different way. Six million. Six million. That's a pretty interesting number, isn't it? Six million. Six million detractors. Banned, 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 banned. Gone. Forever. That's right. This is the United States of Phil. I am the supreme being. I make the rules and what I say goes. Uh, this is not a place for you to stand on your soapbox and complain about censorship and freedom of speech because the bottom line is you don't have freedom of speech. This is my land. So get the fuck out now. So what did you think was going to happen when you started shit talking me in my chat? And if it's like two people, that's one thing. If it's like a large group of my viewers, maybe there's a sacrifice somewhere along the way. That's what we need to open the gas chamber. If you want to support, by all means, please do. Yes, absolutely. Support today would help make up for the fact that I just lost half of my support from yesterday. But I'm not asking for nothing. You want to do it, thank you in advance. Um, you know, the positivity yesterday was amazing. Um, but, you know, support because you like the content. Support because you appreciate the hard work I put in every day. Support because you like me. Support for the right reasons. Don't support to stick it to the trolls. Don't support for all this bullshit. Support because you want to help out and because you like the content and you want it to continue. When life deals lemons, you guys are here to drink the lemonade with me. All right? Okay? Thank you. See, Kyle.